Hi and welcome to the Funk Room channel. Um, right, so the MLA 30 Plus um, is connected to the Airwave 2000 loop antenna element. Um, there is a, a difference between the uh, standard and the plus, definitely. You can hear uh, more on long wave and uh, medium wave, basically. You can hear some long wave beacons. Um, still not as good as the cross country wireless amplifier, though. Um, and looking at something like um, weather reports, obviously, um, where we were getting plus nine or something before, we're now getting you know nine plus ten or something like that on the signal meter. Um, noise floor is a little bit better, I would say, on the plus. And I think they said they were going to try to sort intermod out. Um, I mean, what we notice is. Um, is on here if we put the gain right way to the bottom we've still got an excellent signal um, whereas you couldn't do that before so it, it might be that there's I don't know what they've done with the plus it might be they've just altered the gain and I don't know a few um, components on the board in the amp I'm not really sure I'm not taking one apart um, taking all the epoxy off and everything but um, there's definitely more gain um, because you can have the gain right down on um, on the air spy at least um, and get an excellent signal uh, the same as you could before when the gain was right up um, in fact the gain right up that's there, on here um, there's just too much gain also on the head unit itself the amp itself it's only three quarters up uh, the basically the factory position on the 30 plus whereas I had it full up on the 30 um, I did try briefly putting it up more on the plus version um, but it seemed to be more intermod um, so I turned it down again basically um, down at, uh... So this is the gain right off basically, right to the bottom um, on SDR Sharp. And turning it up, so almost at full stop. Um, so it is, def it is definitely an improvement, uh, even on shortwave. Um, I noticed that there is um, an improvement, which I didn't think I didn't think there would be. Um, but there is definitely, as I say. But you don't have to have the gain all up. We're going to, have to do some experience with the gain adjustment. Obviously, um, I think actually a lot of signals. There's too much gain, um, and we're not hearing them correctly. Um, so there's there's still quite a lot of testing to do. Um, problem being, obviously, is that the test site is um, 30 miles from here because he's operated remotely. So it won't be for a while till I can get there and um, do some gain adjustment settings and uh, obviously report back. Um, but yes, it's definitely worth buying an MLA 30 Plus over the the 30, the normal version, without any question of a doubt. <clears throat> It would even be worth more money, I think, although it is the same money. Um, but on long wave and medium wave, definitely not as good as the cross-country wireless or Wellbrook at this stage. Okay, thanks for watching.